What's going on everybody? Welcome to GMI's World. Today we're going to be learning about the smart route and how you can use out routes to destroy any defense. Now, a lot of people have been playing zone uh, for the most part, even though we've been getting a lot of complaints that zone doesn't work. In my opinion, zones, if certain zones don't play where they're going to be, uh, you know, where they're supposed to be unless you shade them. But that'll be for another time for me to discuss that. But I'm going to show you guys how to make your routes into actual routes that definitely 100% get you the first down. Today, the settings are going to be on all Madden uh, advanced settings. We're going to be using the Tampa Bay Buccaneers offensive playbook and the Oakland Raiders defense, which we won't be actually using defense right now, but that is the defense that I'm currently using when I play Madden Ultimate Team. All right, let's get to the practice field. Okay, so here we go. What we're going to do is I'm going to come out in a very simple uh, shotgun play, maybe just the, like, like all slants right now, because slants, I don't want to do that because the, the tight end goes underneath and it kind of ruins it. I would have to do it to the left side. I don't want to do that. Um, <clears throat> all right, we're going to use tight end option or even weak flood, but weak flood already has it going for a 10 out, uh, a 10 yard out route. So we're going to do the tight end option where we see that the right side receiver is going on a streak, right? And then we're going to just let them pick random plays. Now, let's move the ball back so that we have a little bit of space. I don't like having it uh, where we started off. To move the ball right now is just going to be the actual left trigger and down on the left analog stick, all right? Okay, so here we go. You see how Bryant is in a streak. What we're going to do is we're going to press triangle, or in your case, if you're on Xbox, Y. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to correlate it very, very simply, okay? for I, I'm on PS4, but if I listen, X is going to be uh, square. Triangle is going to be Y. Um, the X button is going to be A, and the circle button is going to be B. I guess it's X, Y, A, B on the uh, Xbox One. Um, yeah, X, Y, A, B, it should be on the Xbox One. So when you see it like that, it corresponds the similar way on your controller. Not a big deal, all right? So here we go. Once you press triangle to bring up your screen to see all the receivers, this is what you have to do. So we're going to use Marta we're gonna use Martavis Bryant. We're going to press circle. Then we're going to press to the right on the left stick, on, on the actual left directional pad. We're going to make him do an out route. That is a regular out route, okay? Now, the steps have to be done exactly like this in order to smart route it. Unless you're going to smart route a route that's already, you know, in the actual route formation that you want, which you can smart route a lot of different routes to make them operate differently. But that's for, like, more of an expert level. We'll get to that at another time. Okay, so now that he's doing the out route that we've hot routed to, we're going to press triangle again. We're going to press circle again. And then we're going to look on our screen on the bottom right, and we're going to see the R1 makes it a smart route. And that's it. So you're going to correspond the first um, icon on the Xbox One controller, the first R, you know, on the right side, the, uh, the, the top, the, the trigger, the first right trigger before the, you know what I'm saying? It's the R1 on the PS4. It'll be, the, it's the same exact thing on the Xbox. And we're going to press R1. Now you'll see that the route goes to exactly 10 yards. This route is so good in Madden 18 because they've gone back to allowing, uh, depending on the receiver, if you play a lot of mutt, and your receiver has good route running, he will eat up most defenders, okay? Be careful against cover two, and you have to be able to see the defense. I'm picking random defenses right now to more show you that if your receivers are decent, you'll still be able to make this throw, okay? So now that we see that he's on a smart route, we go from, you know, doing the regular five-yard out route to a 10-yard out route. So let's do that again. We're going to go triangle, circle, to the left on the left on the directional pad to make it up to make it a regular out route then we're going to go triangle again circle then we're going to just hit r1 that's going to make it a 10 yard out once it's a 10 yard out usually depending on what down and distance um that you have it can be that smart route can go 20 yards if you have a loss on a down or whatever like that and you smart route it it goes wherever the first down marker is okay so here we go. We're going to go ahead and hike the ball. And we're going to see what defensive coverage are in. Perfect, man coverage. We're going to hit him right when he's turning. you got to hit him right when he's turning. And like I said, again, with the route running, it's all depending on the receiver this year. Attributes definitely 100% matter. So you got to watch it. Okay? you got to see it. It looks like man again. Even if it's zone, they probably won't play it the same way. So we're going to do it again really quickly. Triangle, circle, out. Okay, there we go. Triangle, circle, R1. That makes it 10 yards. You're getting a first down usually every time. Obviously, you're going to utilize other plays, and you could do it to either side. Tri triangle, box to the left, makes that an out route. Triangle, box, R1. 
So now you got two out routes. All right, now you just, you know, you're becoming a guru. You know what I'm saying? Now we can go triangle, okay? Then we see E. Rogers in the slot. We'll do triangle again, and we'll do up on the directional pad and just send him on a streak to kind of isolate the defense. And this is, listen, get it. You're going to get a first down usually on most defenses depending on what you see. And like I said, if you're playing on competitive mode, if you make a bad read, it's an interception. So be very careful how you make your reads. Madden 18 is not playing games on competitive mode, okay? So this, the reason that I'm doing this and I'm helping you guys out a lot more this year is because this game is so good and you have to understand that if you make mistakes in competitive mode, arcade mode and sim, you'll get away with things. You're not getting away with it if you're trying to really compete, all right, and, and, and be a competitive player and go out there and beat people down. That's what my objective is, to make you a better Madden player. All right, so now we have two out routes. I'm going to hike the ball. Okay, I see him on the – okay, he's over there again. As soon as you see him start turning, dot him. I go out of bounds, but you can actually steer him upfield this year with the actual – um the steerable rat catch. Okay, so you could actually be using your analog left stick and moving him upfield as you a, after you catches the ball, all right? So now we're going to do it quick. I'm not even going to tell you what I'm doing. This is how I do it when I'm live. All right, bam. And then I'm doing it, and then it's already done. You should know what I'm doing now. Make sure you test yourself. You should know what I'm doing, all right? Look how quick I'm doing it. You know what I'm saying? We're just utilizing the triangle. In your case on Xbox, it would be the Y button. Triangle, bring up the icons, use the icon. Left on the directional pad for the left side, right on the directional pad for the right side, and then R1 after you do the same thing again. All right? That's how quick you got to do it. Quick out routes. We see it. We see it. He's turning. Bam him. Okay, lead him upfield. You see what I'm saying? Now, you're going to give your, you're going to make the defense, they're going to have nightmares. They're going to have nightmares now. Okay? So now we're doing it really quickly again. And then I'm going to do another tutorial because guys want to know exactly um, how to do how to move the ball faster and things like that. So we're going to be doing a lot more things as far as getting your offense uh, up and running and ready to go. But these are things that can help you. See, now he's like in the cover two on that side, so we look at the other side. You see what I'm saying? Let, let's go back to that. Let's look at that on an instant replay. you got to make your reads properly this year because a lot of the things that were going on in previous years, like, uh, for instance, I used to do a lot of swerving in Madden 17. I won't be, Obviously, swerving is not in Madden 18, but like I've been telling a lot of people, I, I, I do what Madden allows me to do. So now that it's not in the game, we're going to be making a lot more reads. If you look at the right side, he's playing like a little cover two type. So we got to identify that and we got to see the coverage and we have to hit the open receiver. If you look in the slot, you'll see that you'll see the slot receiver. He's getting ready to go ahead and do his streak. I could have also inside, inside led him right after he beat the defender, but I'm going for the first down. So the right side is no good. We see the right side is no good. Take a look at the defender. He's all over him. You make this play in competitive mode, especially on all Madden, it's going back for six. All right? It's really, really going back for six. So you guys need to stop. Okay? You got to make sure that you see the field and you know what you're doing. Because those fake dots that were going on in Madden 17 is not happening in competitive mode. So here we go. We identify it. Boom! Antonio Brown cuts. We deliver the ball. Right on the dime. That's how we're moving over here. We're throwing hot ones. All right? Same thing. I'm not, I'm not saying anything. I'm just doing it really quickly. All things are done. Now, in the actual gameplay, after they get to the line, you can audible just as fast. Remember, as of now in Ultimate Team, I don't think there's anybody with the conductor trait that'll give you two hot routes at the same time. But if you're playing regs, you can only do one hot route before you get to the line. After you get to the line, then you can do it as quickly as I just did it. So you see how fast we're moving now? Go to practice mode and practice that. He's open over there, bro. He's open over there. And we're probably going to take this for six, too, because we don't... Oh, 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 okay, now nah, we don't got juke. We don't got jukes like Jagger. All right, but listen, that's pretty much how you're going to beat any defense and how you're going to get a first down probably 85 to 90% of the time. Now, if they start playing different coverages, you're going to have to get uh, a little bit more creative. You know what I'm saying? If they start playing crazy things, maybe you send the slot guy on a slant. All right? See, I sent him on. I, I sent, you see, bro, it's going back for six. Why did I? Why did I do that, bro? I seen him underneath. I still threw it because I don't care, bro. You know, I, I had a Madden 17 moment. Don't worry about it. It's over though. See, when you when you notice the cover two, all right. See, okay, look, all right, okay, okay. So we're gonna hit X. All right. Why did I just throw it off my back foot though? All right. I'll, do yourself a favor. Don't usually once you get your feet set, don't hold on to the left analog stick anymore because you'll get a lot of those where you're throwing off your back foot. Really not good to be doing that. All right, usually when they're like that on the line, I have other plays to beat that. 
But let me see what they're doing. All right, so they're, they're pressing. He could still beat that on an out route. Okay? He could still beat that on an out route. He's probably going to take it for six. Like I said, it depends on your receiver's attributes. So I want you guys to go out there, and I want you to show everybody, listen, I know how to smart route. I can beat these coverages, and I can get her done. You know what I'm saying? Just get her done when you go out there. All right? So we're going to keep moving, throwing hot dots. And um, that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Now you should know how to smart route. Any route, uh, usually right here, this is for first downs. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. Any other questions, you leave it in the comment section. We'll be coming back usually with daily tips as, as quickly as I can. And we're going to make you guys better Madden players. One love.